Welcome to MPS Monitor, the best cloud solution for remote printer monitoring and print fleet management. This tutorial will explain how you can grant access to users in your company or to your customers, giving each one the appropriate access capabilities. In details, you will learn how to create new users with different roles, how to manage, modify, or delete users already created, how to customize the capabilities to be assigned to each user. MPS Monitor allows you to create users for your employees and customers. Users will have the possibility to view and manage all or only some of the functions of the portal based on the capabilities assigned to them. To access the Users Management area, in the left menu click on Security and then on Users. To create a new user, in the Users page, click on Create. You will open a page where you can insert users' data. Enter the field's name and email address. In the Capability Set field, you must select the profile that you wish to assign to this user, choosing from those available in the list. When you select a Capability Set, the list of active capabilities for the selected profile will appear in the right yellow pane. Check carefully to ensure that the user you are creating is given only the right set of capabilities and not more. Be very careful to set the correct association for the user. If you are creating a user for your customer, in the Associated With option, select Customers. Then choose the customer by selecting it from the drop-down menu. In this case, the user will only have access to the data of that customer. If instead you are creating a user for a person in your company who needs to access all your customers, then select Dealer and choose the dealer in the appropriate field. By doing so, the user will have access to all the customers of the dealer. Make sure that you have correctly associated the user with the relevant customer or dealer to avoid the user having access to confidential data. Click on Save to confirm the user creation. The user just created will receive an automatic welcome email that contains a login button that links to the page where to confirm or change the username and set a password of choice. The user will then access the MPS monitor system with the chosen credentials. From the Users page, you can modify or delete any user created in your area. You can also send a new email that allows the user to reset the credentials. To modify or delete users already created, in the left menu, you need to go to Security and then click on Users. In the Users page, select the username you want to modify. On the page that displays the user's data, if you wish to send credentials to the user, click on Send Login Email. The email will be sent automatically. If you want to modify or delete the user, click on Edit. On this page, you can modify user data and capabilities. You can also permanently delete the user from the system. To confirm the changes, click Save. It is possible that you want to assign to your users different capabilities than those provided in the standard profiles. In this case, you can access the capability sets and create custom profiles, which contain exactly the capabilities you want to grant to your users. To create a new capability set, in the left menu click on Users and then on the Capabilities button at the top right. On the page you will see listed the existing default sets that cannot be edited. However, you can always create a new capability set by clicking on Create New. Enter a name and description for the custom capability set you are creating. Then select the capabilities you want to grant with this set. The yellow box shows the actions that are enabled for each category of permissions. When you have completed the selection of capabilities, click on Save. The custom capability set has been created. Returning to the Users page, the custom capability set will now be listed in the Capability Set field. You can now assign this set to your users in the User Creation or Modification page. Thank you for watching this MPS Monitor tutorial.